Well, you know, we uh, like to lighten the uh, mornings, and uh, John will have Dad Joke of the Day coming up in just a bit. But right now, we want to check in uh, with Molly Real. She has found some singing yeah. and some sweets in Folsom. Hi, Molly. Oh, it, we wouldn't, you know, it wouldn't be right to be in Folsom listening to some music without Rick. I hear the train coming, coming around the bend. I ain't seen the sunshine since I don't know when. Stuck in Folsom prison, <laughs> time keeps dragging on. <laughs> Woohoo! Let's hear it for Mr. Rick Esterling. <laughs> now, Rick here, uh, you'll often find Rick here in historic Folsom, right outside Snooks, uh, the candy and chocolate factory. This piano has been here for a couple years. It's been refurbished, restored throughout those years. Isn't it beautiful? Uh, and folks can just come out here and play. You might not sound as good as Rick, but you know what? You can try. So this is Eric Snook. He is third generation here at the, at the Chocolate and Candy Factory. And this is Megan with Visit Folsom. So Eric, tell us about this piano. And I, I, just sitting here this morning listening to Rick play, man, it just lifts your spirit. Yeah, you know, it's uh, it's been a community work in progress. Um, originally, you know, it's been sitting outside, so it's pretty beat up. Uh, my grandfather actually played the banjo in a band, and uh, he just, he really enjoyed it, but he just wanted to hear it tuned and properly. So he kind of came to us and said, hey, what do you guys think about getting this thing fixed up and tuned properly? So we, we got together and, you know, actually uh, Folsom Historic District wanted to put some money in it. So we kind of collaborated and got it all fixed up. And you said people are always playing this. It's constantly being, <laughs> being used. Yeah, it's funny. We, you know, a lot of young kids are coming up, hitting the keys, just, you know, they think it's, it's just cool. And then we have a local TikToker. We've had uh, different bands show up just to jam we had a person drive up hop out of the car practice a personal song and they're just having a good time with it you know just i think really it brings people here and they to live in the moment you know oh i love that and you've got you know candy right behind you so it can't get better megan we were saying you know historic folsom is such a special place as it is what does this do to elevate that experience it's just like during these days it's been real hard for everyone the last few years so it just brings the community together and music is such a gift and it's just so fun like Eric said to see the kids and the families out and how much the community just loves our town like the historic district the city we couldn't do it without everyone so it's a group effort <laughs> I love it and you know what the piano's always there maybe don't do it in the middle of the night but come on out and play Rick why don't you uh, play us out with something we could dance to <laughs> I love that she has backup dancers. <laughs> I've always wanted to play the piano. Right? I don't have the hands for it. They're all, my hands are all busted up from playing football oh, and stuff. Oh, I see, I see. I feel like, like you can still, you can probably still get it. Just wouldn't be like Beethoven-y, yeah. which could be maybe more jazz. No. <laughs> <laughs>